Hey, how you doing? Thought I'd show you how to set up a Word file and put that information in the columns. So what I've done, I've basically typed a page, stuck, inserted a picture, um, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the page layout ribbon and I'm going to select columns. I'm going to put it into three columns. Okay. Now the problem with doing this, let's say I want to put anything after or anything before. Okay, so let's say I wanted to put in a typo. Oh, I didn't put my title in. Okay, so let's put in my title. Oops. Okay, I can put in a title, but it's only going to go in this area. And so what you actually want to do is before the information and after the information, you want to leave a little space. Okay, unless you know for a fact you're not going to be entering any other information in. Okay, and then from there, you select the information, you go to page layout, you put columns, so we're going to choose three columns again. And by doing that, I can then go back and say, hey, you know what? Um, I would like to put my title in the middle of the page. And I get to do that. Okay. One other thing I wanted to show you, um, which is kind of interesting, I'm going to show you how to do a footnote, but it actually... Uh, makes the columns a little bit different. You'll see here I selected my information and it said, oh, okay, you want to take all this information and you want to spread it evenly across your page. When I go to references and I insert my footnote, all of a sudden you'll see that, okay, and I'm, I'm just going to put this is where a footnote would go, but you'll see all my information, instead of going evenly across the page, it's now going down. So it goes down this column first and let's say I were to write a little bit more, I'm just going to press enter for now, then it'll go down this column and then it'll go down this column before it continues down these columns. Okay, so just some information for you to note. Um, hope this helps and have a great day.